How to build Heimdall in 2 minutes or less. Heimdall is a light support unit, she belongs to the Idrisil faction of characters and uses energy as the resource to execute her skills. Heimdall has the ability to share the buffs that she applies to herself with teammates standing inside her ring of reason. For this reason, when building her you can prioritize the level of skill 3 and her ultimate. Skill 3 because most of her support capabilities rely on it, and her ultimate for the skill chain damage if you plan on using her with Okuni. Heimdall's ultimate will provide a 1000 bonus attack power to herself and teammates inside her ring. To bypass this ring restriction just use her with Okuni, otherwise make sure you're standing inside her ring to get the buff. Remember, her buffs are shared with teammates inside the ring, so anyone who is beyond its boundary will not benefit from them. Knowing how mobile some of our enemies can be, staying in the ring can be an issue at times. But that's where her signature functor comes in, in addition to increasing the potency of her buffs, her functor will also increase the size of her ring by 25%. That being said the free-to-play Idrisil functor is more than serviceable. When it comes to sigils, if you're running Heimdall as a DPS, use Obelisk of Light for slots 1, 3, and 5 for the 10% bonus light damage. For slot 2, 4, and 6 use Jormungandr for now, to meet her energy requirements. Later when the Dragon Energy set is released, you can swap Jormungandr for the new set. It will provide better energy generation and extra damage. If your Heimdall is at rank Omega, replace 5 and 6 with 2-piece Nibelung and lead for faster ultimates. If you're running her solely as a support, run Jormungandr or the new energy set for slots 2, 3 and 6. For slot 1, 4, and 5 run Nibelung and lead. As for substats the usual attack, crit rate, crit damage, skill damage or light bonus damage are welcome. Stats like loopback, siphon, calculated reverse, and raptor are also okay but less of a priority. As for ether codes, 3 yellow will provide up to 21% crit rate and 450 extra attack power to the team, use this for main DPS Heimdall. 3 red is solely useful if she's supporting a light team, it provides light shred, and will also allow her to perform additional attacks while a dodge skill is active. 3 blue is fantastic for teams that are very energy hungry. Last but not least, using her combat chip may prove very effective if she is AI controlled, forcing her to target the enemy the team leader is currently engaging. Meaning, theoretically at least, she should drop the ring at your location when it is cast. What do you think about Heimdall? Will you use her as a DPS or a support? If you found this video useful, a like rating would be greatly appreciated.